Hello, everybody. Welcome to Let's Try. My name is Retromation. This is Bio Prototype, a highly customizable arena survival action roguelike that I am very excited to be checking out here today. So I don't cover a lot of different games in this genre because I kind of wait for them to do something, you know, unique and different before I kind of want to showcase them. This one appears to be doing that by apparently giving you free reign. Oh my God, that got loud. Free reign to make your own talent tree, more or less by combining together and stringing together a bunch of different organs and parts, which it sounds very appealing. The, you know, the talent tree part, not necessarily the organ part, but I did see a tutorial over here in the, oh God. Okay, it's a reading one. I'll be right back. I'm gonna, I'll give you the cliff notes. It more or less doesn't seem too bad. Basically, we're gonna be getting cells. That's our currency flasks. Basically, if we don't pick up cells at the end of a wave, they turn into reserve cells that will turn into twice as much value on the next wave. So the, kind of the Brotato system. Uh, organs are the parts that we can pick up that we will slot into the tree. There is one type that is mo mostly like a power generator and one that actually uses that power, kind of. Um, the further some are from the brain, the origin point, apparently the less powerful they'll be. Uh, other than that, yeah, there's some only can be slotted in specific ways. They need a certain type of organ on the left or right. And then we can also recycle uh, ones that we don't want to use. So let's pop on in here. I There are apparently 19 characters, says the Steam page. So that is exciting. Stomy, a prototype with nothing special. <laughs> well, all right, I'll fit right in. Survive 10 waves of enemies, special design stage for new players. Easy research of prototype testing. Uh, only a few types of organ can be used. No, 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 no. Oh my, right on in one second, the audio. All right, okay. So yeah, it's got the standard auto. <laughs> what the hell? The auto aim, the sound. Bloop, bloop. That sound is, is wild. Well, all right. Okay, B-O-T-D. B-O-T-D. All right, clearance reward. Limb of the giant. Tab for my organs. So these are my organs. Okay. Spine of the white fox. Vessel amount one. Activate the right side organ periodically. Once per second at 120 efficiency, we are going to be firing a projectile. Great. Yeah, okay. Sure. Understood. Uh, so we can get another one of these. Activate the right side organ whenever the left side organ hits any target with a 37% efficiency. Or activate the right organ whenever the left crits. So what did that have for crit chance? 20%. Okay, 20% crit chance. Oh, God. 20% chance to proc with 126 efficiency, though. That is appealing. I'll tell you what, let's go with this one. It's, it's reliable. So now we kind of want an organ. Launch a short range attack cone in front of you. Uh, sure. Generate mutants that last for a duration when activated. Mutants cannot move or get damaged. Each organ locates between this organ and brain. Oh, wait, what? Each organ's located, I'm, pro I'm probably assuming. Between this organ and brain reduces fertility by 20%. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah, the fertility of it. Okay, mutation. So we can probably slot this in. So 30, like, with 37% efficiency, we will do the limb of the skeleton whenever this crits. Is there a way? There's got to be a way to split that off into, like, a branching path. Like, maybe later? Or what's this? Yeah, okay, I'm guessing we'll get one later. Culture. I'm a man of culture. New organ. An additional set of brain per level? Excuse me? Brain capacity? Ooh. Where's this for real life, man? Test? So we can just see exactly how it works. Oh, it, oh okay. It's kind of interesting. I will say it's really weird how there's literally zero sound effect for... Um, any of the bullets like it's actually weird very very weird i'll say i like this though seems right to me all right 
so how much damage does that son of a gun do? We, we, we can't tell because we're killing... Okay, it does five. That doesn't seem so bad. It is fun that we launch a, basically our melee attack wherever we hit there. I, I do not mind that at all. I feel like that is that was a fine call. Gives us a little bit of AoE clear. All right, all right, okay. Conceptually, this is this is pretty neat. I do like the high customization factor. Okay, so now let's take a look at my organs here. So this this has no right side compatibility whatsoever. Interestingly enough. Nerve of the Boxer. I'm assuming there's no, like, combining auto-battler style. Activate the right side organ periodically. I mean... Okay. So, oh, there's different rarities, more or less. 0.63 times per second. So, I wonder if... If we launch that out... Oh my god. So this is like... This is pretty darn slow. I'll tell you what. Let's just get the... Maybe get another nerve of the boxer. I, I guess? Or eh, we'll take this since we can't do the other thing right now. 0.33 times per second with massive efficiency. Okay. Curious. Generate imps that last for a duration when activated... Imps cannot move, but can be damaged by you. Okay. Each organ locates between, located between this organ and the brain reduces fertility. I think I'm just going to have to pick this to really know exactly what the hell you're talking about. So where can this go? Could go here. Okay. Oh, what the hell? Okay, let's test it out. So do we summon a, a guy who summons... <laughs> Ow! <laughs> he, say, he summons nothing. Not enough fertility. Wait, what? Okay, so basically by putting this here, is that... <laughs> what the heck? Each organ lo located between this and the brain reduces the fertility by 20%. Apparently, this is enough to ruin it. I can't put it any closer. Okay, well, I think that's useless for me for now. Uh, all right, well, we'll just go ahead and run with the stuff we had prior. The question is, like, if we do this, I feel like it's, yeah, not enough duration. That checks out. So, basically, uh, this would make it so, while the projectile is alive, every 0.63, or, no, 0.63 times every second. So, less than a second. It'd be like, I don't know. I, 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 I would do this. I wouldn't do it that way. But, hey. Uh, basically, the projectile won't be alive long enough for the melee attack to come out is basically what it's saying there. Movement speed, life. Do we want to go with this stuff? I'll tell you what, extra crit chance seems good considering we do bonus uh, a bonus effect. No, we don't. Well, but we know that exists. I'll tell you what, I like critting. I like to crit regardless. It's really interesting. It's one of those ones where like the in-between of the waves is really like a lot longer than, than the waves at some times which is kind of funny alright alright so far so fine so far so fine I would 1000% change the sound effect of the bubble pickup though like dev if you're listening I cannot stress how nice that would be oh shoot limb of the giant a short range attack and a rectangle in front of you whenever activated Okay, so we could trash that for other organs. Deal damage over time to the target when activated. Intestine of the monolith. Spreads effect of the right side organ on the ground. So you need right side compatibility is either wings, belly, or poison bag. I don't think I really have a lot of that. This is a 
limb that is a tentacle. Yeah, so I, I don't have the stuff for that right now, but that is a cool idea. I'll tell you what, the poison bag seems nice. Tentacle of the beetle. Fires whirly projectiles when activated. Maybe. Grants increased movement speed for a duration when activated. The buff uh, effects scales with efficiency of the left side organ. So this is a wing thing. So what if we if we spread this on the ground? Would we spread like an an AOE speed buff? Is that true? Oh my god, we got another one still. Spreads. We could try and spread the poison on the ground. Inflict shock on the target for the duration when activated. Hosts affected by shock take increased damage from all source resource all sources probably debuff effect scales with the efficiency let's go with the intestine for now uh but yeah having this here is a little bit of a tough one so 0.62 times per second is that wait hold on we didn't even swap it oh we can't swap it because this is a an intestine which cannot be connected to the tent. Yeah, I'm mean, sure. Gotcha. Man. All right, so the things that can be connected to this are apparently... Th this can be swapped in its place. We can have... I guess we do this. Because this one can at least put another thing over here, but nothing can be connected to this. Yeah, I think we pretty much have a, a cap right here. Unless we did something like this, which doesn't work. Yeah, this is, this is pretty much the only thing we can do for right now. The question is, what do we want to do on hit? Let's try out the, uh, the whirly projectiles. Let's see what it looks like. What the hell? I guess, you know what we could do? It might be kind of fun. This has no connections at the end of it. Oh, that's so annoying. Because I'd like to have the boomerang at the beginning and then have the, uh, the limb of the skeleton after. That sounds better. This can connect to a nerve, but we just don't really have any. 15 damage, 8 damage. All right. All right. Fine, fine, fine. We'll just leave it at this for now. I was hoping to get stronger. But we're looking for a, uh, a nerve. Another nerve. Because then we could use the other melee in this slot. Oh, boy. I got hit with it? Uh, wait, wait, wait. Really? Hitbox? Okay. It's fine. It's fine. I really want to scoot around. I can't wait until we could get, like, another attack. That must be possible. Surely it's possible. All right. Scoot, 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 scoot. Very risky, but I'm fine. Ah, come on, man. I can't get in. I was fully expecting to take a hit there. I'm glad I did not. Okay, one second left. Eh. I'll take it. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Activate the right side organ when the left side expires. That seems usable. Heart. Activate the right side organ after four seconds without taking damage. Oh, that's that is spicy. That is very spicy. We could refresh here. Belly of the Schrodinger. Inflict Wither on the target for a duration when activated. Targets affected die instantly when their HP falls below a certain threshold. The debuff effect scales with the efficiency of the left. What the heck, though? This can connect here, which could then connect an intestine. All right, fine. Let's give it a look. And then it splits into the... Okay, what the heck? So maybe... 
This can't go there. This has to be... We need something that can connect to the belly. The nerve cannot be uh, the first thing. We need something like a spine. Okay. Inflict wither. When okay, when yeah, when they fall below a certain threshold, three percent. What the heck? So when do we activate the things on the right? This doesn't activate the things on the right. This gives us more ability to put down spines. What the hell? There's no way. Does that that really can work? I don't believe you. I do not believe you for one second that this is actually going to do anything. What the heck? What on earth? It actually is working, but it's like... What's making it proc? Because this just happens periodically. It all has to be from this one projectile. I'll tell you what, let's just give it a go. Seems spooky. Okay. What on God's green earth? This is absolutely strange. But it's like working really well. I'm seeing the 53 damage, but I think that's just whatever happens when um, they get under the 3% threshold. Like, I'll, I'll, I'll take it. It checks out for me. I'm, I'm good with it. Let me in. Let me in, dude. God, I just feel like I need another attack that's... Oh, my God. Let me in. I hate you. Let me in. There we go. Oh, it is satisfying. As annoying as the sound is, when you get in and you get a million, it's like... You know it's... You know it's going well. Very easily. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay. Uh, Lung of the Narwhal. Atomizes the effect on the right... S atomizes the effect of the right side organ and makes it surround. Okay. It's a blue quality one. Is a lung... Grants increased organ activation rate for a duration when activated. But the buff effect scales with the efficiency of the left. What the hell, dude? I think we may need to just skip some stuff because it's getting it's getting a little chaotic here. I feel like another poison bag is maybe fine. Activates the right side organ while hosts affected by the left side organ die. I mean, that seems kind of fun. Oop. I didn't pick that. Did it get trashed? Guess it must have. Alright, so... Right side compatibility nerve. Do we have any nerves? I do not... This can go here, but I don't know what this does. Not enough fertility. I mean, it makes sense. I've got nothing for this. Yeah, we have we have no more nerves, which checks out. Fires a whirly projectile. When the left side expires. Duration 3.14 seconds. So, okay, so when that, uh, the debuff on them expires, we, uh, we then apply this. And this is just happening periodically. While the debuff is on, I guess is the, uh, the requirement. Just while the debuff is going, that happens. So this, I feel like... The debuff effect scales with efficiency. So that's why it's down to 3%. But I don't really care about that. Like, it's nice and all, but it's really just there so that I can apply more abilities. Like, truthfully. I think we just go for a couple melees, right?
32 versus 40. Radius three point. This is a bigger radius. Let's have a mix of them. We, we're at eight, a maximum of eight parts anyways, apparently. So sure. So yeah, basically when the three seconds is up. Oh, what the hell? What the hell? I don't know if I like that. That's this? Eh, whatever. Good enough. You can only mess with it for so long. Oh my. Okay. So three seconds and then kaboom. Three seconds and then they uh, they explode more or less. I thought that we would have taken damage there for sure. Okay. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Yeah, I'd I'd love the amount of damage we do and the, what, and the fact that it's AOE and all. But I do wish we had more like immediate direct damage because I'm having so much trouble getting in to pick up the extra cells. Like we just don't have enough immediate kill power for that. We really should uh, go to that buff tree though. I'll tell you what, we, we're, we're, we're saving. Let's call it that. Oh, I thought you guys were going to be... Oh, I thought they were going to all be dead. Just live, just live, 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 live. Okay, I'm fine. Atomize the effect. I mean, I kind of want to check out the atomization. But that would be in place of something like this, which I can't really swap right now. Uh, nerve. Nerves, absolutely. This is a blue rank nerve. Activate whenever anything happens. Sure. Culture. We have a, a lot. Transform cells into a new organ. Eh. Additional set of brain. I mean, I'm going to do that because... Does that mean we get another... Oh, what the hell? Okay, so yeah, it is straight up an extra, an entire extra set of abilities. Great. Movement speed up sounds really important. Crit chance. We could sell duplication. Base damage? Oh, please. Let's go for it. A little bit more movement speed as well. And let's get some organ quality. Then we'll go for the extra brain next time. So we got it. one from... Right from the base, we can start here. So this atomizes something around us. Poison? Theoretically? Do I not? Oh, okay. Oh, so it totally does work. Why did it take so long for it to happen the first time? I mean, that's really cool, though. Atomizes the effect of the right side organ. Duration, 2.98 seconds. It happens every point... Okay. Oh, point 0.17 times per second. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That checks out. We could also get the Wing of the Fairy. We could get, like, really boosted. But I... Like I said, I kind of just wanted something to destroy the immediate area around me. So we could have it happen faster. 0. 0.1 times per second. No. I kind of, I do kind of want to look at what it seems like if it was just quicker. So we can make it happen literally always. But it seems like it kind of sucks when we do that. It's like, it's not very strong. Oh, that doesn't work. Let's get the blue one on. Let's be honest. So it takes a little bit for it to charge up for the first time for some reason. I have no idea why it takes so long the first time. Because then it's... Then it's a lot quicker. But that's... I really like that. Alright, we should be theoretically a lot stronger this way. 
So now we have something to... Oh, yes. Absolutely. Way better. Not to mention the movement speed up. Everything is kind of in a uh, delayed fashion, though. Yeah, God. The, <laughs> the sound effects... And there's something about, like, the, the visual chaotic nature. And also the lack of sound effects at the same time. It's, there's so much, so many weird things, but, like, let me be honest, it it is all taking a backseat to just how truly customizable I have to. It's already so low. Uh, it's taking a backseat to truly how cool and customizable it is, like, that is definitely taking the cake. All right. So we've kind of figured out the... Uh, I think we figured out the system a little bit more now. A little bit better. Zoop. Oh, God. I thought you would have gotten it by then. Maybe we get a pickup radius. That might do a lot for us. Boop, 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 boop. Okay. Heart of the Living Dead. Activate the right side organ on death? <laughs> what? <laughs> Activate the right side periodically. Retina of the Raven. Oh, wait. Ooh. Uh, limb of the Giant splits into double nerves. Right side organ while well, the host affected by the left side die. I'm going to get that because it splits into two. That just seems really good. So now we kind of are looking for nerves, I suppose. New brain? Nah, new brain. Wait, your brain is able to control two additional organs per level? Oh, I see what you're saying. Two additional, like, maximum. Gotcha. Pick up range up. I'll take a life up. Okay, so now we got another thing from the beginning. That That's tapped out, and I think it's honestly, it's fine. So this activates two things periodically. That can proc two extra things when this crits. That is a 33% crit chance, so it's not, it's not you know, it's going to happen decently often. So we'll do that. This will be the, uh, whenever this crits, even more crazy things happens. So this should be... This happens where I am, right? Like, this is a melee attack in my melee vicinity. I mean, hell. Just drop it all in right now. I don't even freaking know. So this is a movement speed increase on crit. <laughs> this is going to be nuts. Or no, organ activation, right? Does this have higher crit? No, it absolutely does not. Activation rate multiplier, 16%. I think this is... That's fine. And then this is what? Short range attack. Whenever this one hits any target. Maybe we do this then. So like, whenever this hits any target whatsoever, we're going to get an activation rate multiplier up, modifier up of 4%. Actually, that's stupid. This, I mean, these all suck. You know, 39% is not going to be very conducive uh, to success. Need more capacity. Oh, I'm over capacity. I'll tell you what. Screw this, then. This doesn't even need to be there. It's, it's nothing. All right, what the hell is happening now? I think it takes a little bit to... Uh, Okay, so we have a little bit of the slams happening every once in a while right by us. Culture, we're all good. All right. Weird as hell. Absolutely weird as hell. But we have a, we got another thing. Yeah, it's tough to kind of see enemies that are very, very close to me. I'm going to need a speed upgrade. If we're going to have enemies that are running towards me at that speed, we need to speed upgrade. I can't see Jack Squat behind all of my attacks. Oh, 
<laughs> Ooh boy. Audio balance. How how is it possible in an, in an indie game? You'd think. You'd think it's not possible. Okay. Did not get hit there, which is great. Sure seemed like I would have. All right. Activate chaos. I love when the slam crits and activates just another slam. There's something funny about that. Go for, like, the double dunk. Oh, God. Here we go. Very nice. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. It's not coming. Seems like we get healed up at the beginning of every wave, though, which I, I actually really like. I like that it's kind of a finite health system, but also that you get healed up. Because then we can do kind of crazy stuff like that that I didn't think I could do at first because I thought it was permanent. That was obviously risky at the end, but like, hey. Uh, what was it to... Un to How do <laughs> Wasn't it right click? I'm right clicking. Maybe we can't do it there. Can we right click over here? Oh, it's delete. I think we'll just trash a bunch. I think we got too much going on. Okay. Poison bag of the thorn. Host affected by the left side die. I mean, this can... So, yeah, that can attach to retina. What else can attach to retina? It'd be nice if there was, like, a filter system so you could, like, press... I need something that will filter into a retina. I think if you click it when you're in there, it would, it would give you that. I'm going to grab this. When damage is taken, activate. Eh, nah. I mean, a thou with a thousand percent efficiency, though? Maybe that is worth it. Maybe that is worth it, then. I'm going to say no, though. Slime. Alright, what on earth have we done? We really can't change that much right now. This is weird and chaotic. It's already we're at the max capacity of the eight there anyways. When the run expires. 347. 361. We might as well do this one, I guess. And we can do that. And we're at 8 out of 8. 76. 41. I think that's fine. There's not much else we can do with that. We go to the culture, though. I can get another brain. My final brain. Alright. We'll do that. This can secrete poison on the ground that then... Okay, when the poison expires, launch a short-range attack that also... Okay, well, whatever. Sure. Am I right? Yeah, so we, we put on poison, and when that poison expires after three seconds, we will launch a short-range attack. So it's going to probably take a little bit, but yeah. So we can drop poison on the ground, which puts on a poison that when it expires, it's supposed to do a short-range attack. Not that it really matters. This limb of the germ rat, I feel like I haven't been able to, like, I just haven't really seen it do anything. Oh, there it was. That AOE. That, like, circle blast. It happened, like, once. I mean, I don't really care. It's fine. It's all gonna be good. 
I'll increase my organ quality. Like, it's just nice to have yet another attack is really the thing. We're going to want to speed upgrade at some point. Okay. Okay, they're starting to get a lot more health. Trust. Trust the poison. Trust the poison. Trust the po What the- See, okay, what the hell? It- it happened. It procced. It's happening sometimes. That, like, more circular almost happened, like, up there. Right there. The poison has to officially stop ticking on them, I guess. I mean, that makes sense. Like, there's a big ticking timer, and when it goes off, they, like, they unleash absolute hell. Okay. I'm really loving the big AoE circle poison, though. Like, that's that was the secret MVP of the whole thing. The not-so-secret MVP. I really... Okay, I was gonna say, I really thought somebody would be dead by now. Okay, we got a lot of stuff. Legendary Spine of the Mammoth. Uh, Nerve of the Boxer. Whenever... Okay, 53% effectiveness whenever anything happens. Okay, cool. Belly of Schrodinger. Legendary. I don't really care. We'll probably ditch one of these. Fire projectiles that trace targets automatically. Interesting. I feel like some more nerves is not a bad idea. This should just be a straight up improvement. Yeah, it happens more powerful and more often we do it's the limb of the giant thing though I, f I wonder if maybe we well we might as well do this right it makes it a lot slower but it makes the projectile a lot more powerful The mammoth is... Jackal is a bit quicker. Quicker and more efficient. Let's see that in action instead. It does, it'll does. it do a little bit less damage, but we're shooting more projectiles. More projectiles means we're doing that effect more often. Like the weird dumb slam thing. We're still at 8 out of 8 on this. We can't do anything. This we could theoretically do a lot, but I just... I'm so happy with just exactly, exactly how it is. That I'm not really interested in touching it. 0.2 times per second. I, I'm not interested in touching it because it's just... It's working too well. Okay, so whenever it hits... These things happen with whatever efficiency. We can do that as well. I feel like there's got to be somewhere that that was useful. Nerve of the Boxer, we might as well do this. It just makes it just makes this stronger. It makes the, our, our death threshold into 5% instead of 3 that they'll just auto-die. Oh, this doesn't even need to be here, which means we can get an extra effect out of this. Great. Movement speed, please. Where the hell? What am I looking for? Oh my god. Blind. Organ quality up. At this point, I ca yeah, I kind of just want the quality up. Okay. Yep. 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 A lot's happening. Yep, a lot's happening. 
so the uh, the AOE poison spin thing, it it caps it out, right? Like there's nothing that can attach to it at the end. Pretty sure. Otherwise, I would have. I, I feel like I would have found something. It must just be a, an end cap point, which makes sense. It's a very very strong ability. This movement speed is a godsend. Warning? I've been warned. Thoroughly. Uh, excuse me? Excuse me? Rude dude? He's dead? Legendary something or other? I think pickup radius is next. But we are able to actually, like, sit in a smaller radius now. Please. Oh boy. I yeah, I can't see you can't see Jack squat. So wave ten, that was where the uh Oh my god. Where the other one ended. Retina of Raven? That was the that wasn't the fancy thing we got, was it? Wing of the Giant Bat. Grant increased organ damage for a duration when activated. Oh, I mean, we gotta probably do that. Limb of the Germ Rat. 0.18 times per second. What is this? So it's ever so slightly worse, but the efficiency is... So much better. Ever so slightly slower. I shouldn't say worse. That's misleading. Okay. I'm going to get some pickup range. Getting up extra brain capacity does sound good. But I'm going to keep on going for organ quality for now. Yeah, whatever. All right. I, I wish this had, uh, I wish this split off into two things. That's going to be really, really nice, though. So this split into wings? This does split into wings if we want it to. So an 8% damage modifier? Whenever this hits, we get an 8% damage modifier. Or we could get a 16 whenever it crits. Might as well just straight up upgrade that one. I feel like we probably have a straight up upgrade for this too. Oops, we do. But... We can also just drop like something in here. 97. Dang, man. All right. I'm just going to trash all the commons at this point. Oh, I think a trash did not come. All right. Um, cell duplication. That seems like something we probably should have gotten earlier too, but oh well. All right. So our AOE is going to be ever so slightly slower, but it's going to be more effective. Yeah, it's, it's after the first activation which is inexplicably slow, it is barely slower. And it's made up for it by being bigger as well, so, like, it doesn't even matter. The efficiency is not just the damage, but also the size. We've made... We've made chaos happen today. Yeah, we're going to go for brain power, brain capacity next, I'd say. Because then we can up everything up to 10. I don't know what we'll really do with that, what kind of thing we'll actually add. It'll just uh, it'll just make our chaotic effects even more chaotic, I guess. I do, like... they. It was mentioned that, uh, like, whenever it's out of early access or whatever, there's going to be twice as many characters. I'm very curious to see, first of all, what do the characters change? And then, of course, second of all, 
um, you know, what are the other organs? What kind of other organs are in the game? And uh, when you double the amount of organs, which is planned, theoretically, that's going to shake up a lot. Oh, 100%. Okay, I didn't get enough. Kind of want to sell some stuff then. I don't know. If the, it's probably not going to give us... Oh, I have to sell one more thing and then I can actually. Hmm. So we do... Doesn't split off into two like I want. There we go. Brain capacity up. So now we can add more stuff. It says need more capacity, but we don't anymore. That is now a lie. I mean, we don't... <laughs> but unfortunately, we, we now don't have the stuff that actually would benefit from it. Unless we take from somewhere else. Like, take from something stupid. And put it back. Which we could do. Yeah, doesn't matter. I'll wait till next time. Regret. Regret. Bo -do -do. Sorry, I'm chasing you down. The big garlic that I made truly is the uh, the best thing. Everything else is really nice, but boy, it's so reliable. Oh, God. Wave's getting a little bit spicy, though. It's starting to get a little bit spicy. Zoop. We need to make sure that we tactically guarantee the small little jellyfish are inside our circle. Ah, I thought that maybe I was fine. That was risky, but it's good. 36 seconds left. Actually, this is spicy. This is genuinely getting spicy all of a sudden. It's mostly the jellyfish, let's be honest. Which, how do we deal with them? Mostly more movement speed at this point. Which we could get by either upgrading our movement speed. Oh, God, I don't want that. But I want that, but I don't want to die for it. We could get by upgrading our movement speed or by upgrading that wing effect. If we can, if we can find one. Okay. Belly of the Fire Lizard. Inflict blaze on the tar target for the duration when activated. We stack multiple times. Each stack has its own duration. Oh boy. Spine of the chimpanzee. So the different spines just seem like different speeds. Like Mammoth is slow, but very powerful. Chimpanzee is kind of in the middle. White Fox is faster. Uh, and then there is the Jackal, which is much faster. Okay, Tentacle of the Worm. Is going to be a nice thing. Retina of the Raven. We need um, we need more actual organ buff and activation rate. Ay, ay, ay. Fine. Fire projectiles repeatedly when activated. Spine of the chimpanzee. Offspring of the mutant. I, I have no freaking clue, man. I want to stop rolling, though. Last one. Limb of the Giant. I feel like, yeah, we're just looking for attack things. I'll take another poison. I'll take the final movement speed up. I guess I'll take, I'll take life up as well. If I'm a little bit worried now. Oh, shoot. Whenever this is anything, this does this. Which can split off and do what? Oh my god. 
with 150% efficiency whenever this crits. It's a 36% chance to crit. It's not that great. But it happens with really good efficiency if it does. Oh, but... But we're at 10. This is some garbage. This is some garbage I made up there. Kind of want to take that and put it over here or something. Okay, this is when the poison deactivates. I feel like I want another... I want to make this a more reliable thing right here. This is like the stuff that's right up in our face. So I'd rather make that more reliable, I think. So whenever it crits, what happens? Damage over time. Uh, sure. We'll get the speed up instead. We have no more nerves. I don't think we have anything. Oh, ooh, this can connect to a spine. Chaotic. Absolutely chaotic. Just sure. Just sure. Absolutely stupid. This, should I change it up? Oh, I guess I can. Oh my god! Wait! Huge? This has co compatibility? When the host affected by this die... Oh my god. Then what? No, we need to take something else here. We need to... We need to yoink. We need to yoink. This is game-changing. All right. Well, but we won't be able to see it in action, really, because they won't die. But it just does a lot more damage. I What, what could we go wrong? It, it just does more damage. I'm going to just cap it out there, because we you, you can really just, exp just go with that forever. God, why does the first one take so long? Yeah, look at this. It's so stupid. Yeah, I, I figured. I figured that was going to get dumb. We got the ability for it to connect to something else. It is it is stupid. Obviously, if uh, if they don't die from it, we are in trouble. But it does enough damage for me to not be worried about that fact. Zoop. Yeah, I'm excited to see more parts. I wonder if you wonder if you unlock more as you play more. As well, because I feel like I'm seeing a lot, a lot of dupes. Like a lot of the things that aren't dupes that I'm seeing are really high quality things that you're not going to find that often. But it's in early access, so even if that is an issue, like that'll be panned out. I like I. They are saying that you know they're going to be doubling the amount of stuff in it, and I'm going to trust it. And I also haven't seen uh, how different the other characters are yet. The big things I'd be worried about are more like the quality of life things. Like, there's the sound effect issue of the bubbles, the sound effect issue of there not being any sound effects sometimes, audio balance. It's mostly quality of life stuff here and there, and like the little bit of the obscurity and strangeness um, that sort of it could be ironed out in the, uh, the building process. Oh, God, what? You know what? I'm going to grab this. taking all the rares <laughs> no thought just take rares i think just some base damage why not okay what can we really even adjust at this point i can't i can swap this out but it won't be able to link into this If this is capping out anyways. So we need a nerve. We could like steal a nerve from somewhere else. I'm going to steal this nerve. It's 
so it's only whenever this crits. Uh, I mean, it's fine. Whatever. When it crits, we get another explosion. Fire a projectile that trace automatically. That seems nice. So there's the AoE. All right, that's fine. Which spine is that spine of the chimpanzee? I, I could. Basically, if I want this to be quicker, I think I do. It also gives us a third splitting point. Not that that's really going to do anything for me right now. I'm not. I don't got any. I don't got anything for that. Uh, but yeah, we have another spine. If there's ever, if there's another spine place anywhere else, is there? Is there? Is there? Let's see it. Part of me wants to steal this and put it on my uh, poison thing. What's the crit of this? 140. Okay, so 25. 30 crit on that. Let's exchange these. Oh, it can't. Oh, it can't go into the other one. Okay, never mind. Can this? Nope. Do we have a slam hammer anywhere else? 33. the hell? Missing tip. Oh, I didn't even remember where this... Where did this go? come from? This was just in here. So whenever this hits the target... So I can't take that back. This can go... This can go there? That doesn't make sense. Whatever. Slap that down. Then we slap this down. And then we slap this down. And then I guess we could slap this down. Oh, this is chaos. This is absolute chaos. I'd rather have this um this further up somewhere else. I'd rather have that there and have the slam back here. I did really like the slam. We're at eight. Nine. Whatever. Whenever we crit, we'll get cooldown reduction. Wonderful. Get some cooldown reduction here. Whenever that wears off, we can get nothing. What's going on here? Just every once in a while, we're gonna do some slams. Great. Just, just every once in a while, come on and slam, basically. Okay, so this is all tapped out. That's okay. That's good. That's good. That's good. We have one extra slot here, so when that wears out, we can have it do the boomerang. Great. Let me just make sure I didn't ruin every single thing under the sun. Okay, I love that the slams are happening way more often. Yep. The AoE didn't show up, but I am assuming it will. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> that still is doing its thing. That's absolutely still doing it. It's, yep. I love those two. It's kind of tough to see, but those two homing ball things that show up out of there. I hath created hell. Just the moment we found the AoE poison is when everything went to hell. For them. For you. Fair enough. I just, I kind of am assuming everything is going to be dead before we get there. Legendary poison. I do kind of, like, I'm very curious about, like, the AoE materialized, like, melee attacks and stuff as well. Because this ring is just the same thing that is uh, making these little poison pools on the ground. It's the exact same thing. Whoop. Super dumb. Alright. Yeah, I think that uh, if wave 15 is the final, I think we absolutely have it. 
fine. Lungs of the Narwhal. Just take legendaries. Okay, pick up range. What else? Anything else just for strength? Crit chance. I mean, crit chance is nice considering there's all those crit chance uh, mutations and everything. Whatever. Whatever, whatever, whatever. This, oh, this is capped out. Is there anything that's not capped out? This is not capped out. Okay. Sure. Oh, God. What? What hell hath I wrought? You create these, which then makes a lung, maybe? That does the poison. M8. And when that poison runs out, nothing happens. I have no, nothing for that. So how do these work over here? Can they? Do I have a chimpanzee by chance? I would have to spider the white fox here. But nothing can hook onto it. Yeah, I'm I'm out of I'm out of things for afterwards. I think we're pretty much done here, right? I think let's be honest. We could upgrade something else somewhere else, I'm sure. But like that's the that is the kind of one issue, is like it does get quasi tedious at that point. And by that I mean like Get, it could get very tedious. So we really want this person to die in a group of other f fools. Yeet. Okay. The power spike is very noticeable, which sucks because we're a build that is very good after we um, kill enemies. Like, But we have to kill enemies for our build to be very good. When we do that, we're we're killing it. We're very well off. Woo! Scoot, scoot, scoot. Scoot, scoot, scoot. I don't know if this line is like instant death or something or what. It shouldn't be. It might do damage to us, though. My guess is that. Just small space. Oh. Tiny, tiny, tiny. I have an itchy nose. Come on, man. Come on, die one of these days. Is it taking a lot? I think it's it's taking a lot less damage than the other enemies. I don't know if it can die. I assume it can. Otherwise, why would it Whoa. take damage? Things are getting spicier. But as they get spicier, we also do more damage. Whatever that slam is, is doing tons of damage to her anyways. Good thread the needle. <laughs> the sound effects having to be so low. Prototype genius. Organ, bladder. Okay, good, good. You do get more. Squander, organ root, gland, harmony. Stage two. Okay, I'm very curious. And then we're back to the music of the main menu being way too loud. Yeah. like, But when the, the worst parts of the game are, like, audio balance related, eh, I mean, it's, it's fine. I'd say, like, you know, I could spruce up the... Uh, the font and everything as well, like just minor things here and there. Like this font is so default. Uh, but like it, it's minor. But you know, p the average person who just like goes onto Steam, buys a game, and opens it will be influenced by that kind of thing and not know it, or maybe they do. Uh, this organ, the organ next to your brain, has a bonus fifty percent efficiency. Can have eight brain sets, but can have only four organs linked to each set of brain. That's actually really cool. Every unique organ linked grants 5% increased organ efficiency. Your brain is disabled unless the amount of organ types ex Wait. Unless the amount of unique organ types exceeds the amount of your brain sets. 
I think I understand. Uh, so we also unlocked a couple things in here. I don't know if we'll get to see them or not. Wing of the Dragonfly, that was the movement speed thing. So yeah, these are all the organs. So there's there's a couple left to unlock for sure. To be sure, there's certainly some left. Bing, bang, boom. Uh, yeah, very, very cool. I mean, there's look at how many characters though. Like that's super cool. Lose all of your cells at the start of every wave. Culture room costs 20% less cells. Oh, I like that. All right. I, yeah, I really enjoy this. I think that, um, yeah, it is in a sea of games trying to just cash in on the Vampire Survivors or Brotato hype. Um, this stands out. This stands out as doing something new. It has polish elements that I think need to really be applied to it over the course of early access. I think that there's... Uh, it's mostly visual, a little bit audio, things like that. But considering that's the case, that's not that bad. Those things can be fixed up. They really, really can. It's not a core design philosophy issue. I will say that like you will probably run the risk with a lot of players who are launching it up, though, and getting to that creation screen. And you get to kind of where I was after I've been in the run for an hour. I go into the screen. I, have, I totally have things I could modify and upgrade, but... It's like, you're, you're an hour in and you're like, I mean, I don't know. Could I get an extra 10%? I guess so, but I don't really want to. So, like, there's a little bit of that. Like, that's the only core design philosophy issue that I, I see here. Um, is that, like, people might not bother. They may find it too tedious as you get later and later into the run, like, even modifying stuff. But that that's a user issue. It depends from user to user. I certainly would get annoyed sometimes by the end. But it's also kind of really fun too to mess with it like i i would wager that half this video was spent in the combat and half would be spent actually prototyping and i think that that's actually probably true of most players like i know that there's probably some people out there at some point like get on with it just put just put the freaking module in whatever put the organ in way you know like but it's that's if you're playing that's what you do you do that you will be trying to min max out all that stuff otherwise that's like otherwise you're probably just going to want to play something else you're going to want to play a different arena survival roguelike right but for the people who want to do that this one i highly recommend uh with a couple caveats that hey maybe play on mute <laughs> but alas that's that it's gonna do it here for today thank you for watching check out the channel for roguelikes and more every single day and i will see you next time bye